all of the uh, farm workers in strike here in uh, Delano are appalled at the shooting of Marcelino Barajas and Paul Salgado. We, we've known now for over 10 years that the strike breakers and the growers are armed. We communicated this to Sheriff Wiley. There's been now, this is the eighth incident, incident where we have had shootings at us last week. Five days ago, another striker was uh, wounded when uh, a strike breaker or a grower, we don't know who, from inside the fields, fired through the rear window of the car and, and injured him in the back. We charge that the arming of the strike breakers and the growers is with the consent and with the knowledge and with the encouragement of Sheriff Wiley. They have known that, that the men are armed inside the fields and they have done absolutely nothing to try to uh, correct the situation and take the guns and the rifles away from them. We had a number of men jailed and beaten and we cannot get the sheriff to tell us the whereabouts of their names. We estimate about 20 people were, were arrested at the Masekian Ranch a while ago when these men were beaten and they will not tell us the whereabouts of the, of the people who are beaten, how seriously they are, or they will not tell us how many people are in jail or which, in which jail they, in jail they are. We want the sheriff's department investigated. We want to know why uh, the sheriff the refuses to to go into the fields and take the arms away from those men. We also want to know why the sheriff is making a special point of uh, these, uh, these raids and these beatings on our picket lines. Brother Juan Cervantes, Cervantes, a 19-year-old picket captain, was threatened, was told by one of the, uh, one of the uh, sheriff's uh, deputies in that, in that goon squad, was told that we're going to kill you, son of a bitch. We know where you live and we've got your license plates. And several of the picket captains have, have received that kind of treatment from these outlaw cops. And we want that stopped, and it's got to be stopped immediately. Uh, you have made accusations about the sheriff department uh, defaming your people and uh, Call it, calling, calling us names. Greasers, calling us greasers, dirty Mexican greasers, calling us uh, spicks. And it's really uncalled for. I wonder where these men are. We'd like to know these men are on the payroll of the county or where they're being financed through, through Sheriff Wiley and through the growers' uh, uh, funds. We want to know the growers are financing that kind of operation. What, what I you want to, you're, not, you're not a newsman. You're not a if newsman. If I ask you a challenging you're not, question, I defending. told you, I told you, and I said, you give me the names. We're negotiating good faith. Don't put that in my face. Go ahead. I'm upset at you. Why? I, I, I expect more professional listen from, from reporters. Sir, I just asked you a question. I, I, need, I expect more professional listen from just, reporters. The <coughs> would like to Fine. ask some questions. Ask a question. He's, he's okay, talking well, to me. Why don't you be quiet? No, we want legislation that truly be helpful to us, but we're not going to give our right to strike and boycott. Never. We can't.